Hello friends, Kishan is here again and welcome you in this video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we are going to have look into a functional interface is called Boolean Supplier. So this interface basically belongs to the java.util.function package and uh, you can see the java doc on the top of this functional interface saying that represents a supplier of boolean valued results this is the boolean producing primitive specialization of supplier there is no requirement that a new or distinct result be returned each time the supplier is invoked right so there is not necessary always you'll get the different value right that might return the i mean same value uh, every time uh, this is a, a functional uh, interface whose functional method is get as boolean right and this has been added in jdk 1.8 and this is annotated as a at the rate functional interface indicating that this is a functional interface and this is a, the, this interface as a method is called get as boolean so let's try to understand how we can make use of boolean supplier uh, through an example right so i have created a project with name boolean supplier functional interface demo and here just i have created a class with main method and here i am going to show you how to make use of boolean supplier so sorry boolean supplier and say that bs and if you look into the method this method does not take any parameter right so we can uh, this method does not take any parameter so we can we can write lambda expression for this method as like this and let's this returns true always all right and you can say bs dot get as boolean right and this will return you or oh, true all right so it's returning true now i'm going to declare like int x equal to 100 and int y equal to 70 and here i will check I, i'll use the same reference over here bs bs equal to again i'm going to write a lambda expression for uh, this method get as for this method get as boolean so here i'm going to check and just write a lambda expression for this and i'm going to check x greater than y or not if x is greater than y then this is going to return true and if i try to get the billion boolean value bs dot get as boolean then this is going to return true right because here x is greater than y so if you look into the output so first output for this one this will return always true because we have just hard coded this value right and here this is also returning a true if i say reverse x less than y then this is going to return false all right so this this is a very quick video on boolean supplier functional interface i hope you enjoyed learning this video uh, i'm going to upload this source code on github and github location i'm going to specify below to the video description so that you can download and uh, you can run on, run on your local computer so thanks for watching this video and see you in the next video tutorial